Hi there, this is a tutorial about the random stack generator. So when you open the file, this is what you see. You have all these pillars and they are made from different elements. So if we click one of them, then here you see all the parameters and in these folders are all the different elements. So here I turn all these pillars off. We can check what is inside. So here we have two elements. Here we have three different elements. And also the bottom part. So it's split in three uh, folders, bottom, middle and top. And by these collections, we can here in the parameters, uh, the first one is the distance between the different, uh, the three sections. Um, here we can say how much top we want so we can say uh, here the middle count is five make them a bit shorter so we can have multiple tops on top of each other in my design they don't really stack nicely but maybe in your design they do uh, the middle count two three you see it jumping around because some parts are shorter than others and we have the random seed so we can just make another uh, on a, another stack um, we have the amount rotation so it's set to 90 so it's allowed to rotate randomly uh, with 90 degree angles so if we set it to 180 it's just gonna flip all the time and the middle distance is uh, between all the middle parts you can give it a distance and also for the bottom, you can say here it has two bottoms, three bottoms, four. And this way it becomes really easy to just generate stacks of stuff. And here it's a pillar and you can also do it with all kinds of uh, elements that you like to stack. And it will measure the height of your elements and then stack accordingly. So if we go into the other one. And we have a random stack of books where it doesn't have a top and bottom part it's just one stack of objects so you can say how many you want and seed rotation object seed and also the rotation amount so here you see when we set it to 10 it will um, look like it's placed randomly if we put it to 90 it will be exact angles and we also have an object distance so this way it becomes really easy to make random stacks of stuff so I hope you enjoy it